electorally, RFK Jr.'s like having an ad run during the Super Bowl is, is probably one of the greatest things to happen for Joe Biden. Like if, if we gotta if we if we gotta be completely honest here, RFK is gonna pull way more people from uh Donald Trump than Biden is good than than Biden. You know, just that that's the facts. Like the Kennedy name will do will do, will help pull some from Biden, but like his policies are all Trumpian, you know? So I'm I'm excited for this. I think this is a net win for uh the Biden electoral campaign, which is important. To stave off fascism. Yeah, Erica, we're doing an early stream today. Just take me to the Twitter. My God, search engines are bad. RFK is making his whole family hate him. Well, yeah, but let's be honest. They probably all hated him before this anyway for being like a crazy, like conspiratorial crank, you know? It's just now that now everyone in the world knows that he's a crazy conspiratorial crank. Yeah, like we're like like Kennedy is a guy who appeals to, you know, folks old enough to have remembered voting for J like JFK, right? Like he's going to disproportionately pull that demographic, which disproportionately is conservative, you know? RFK is entirely unelectable based on voice alone. I mean, sure, I, but like he's he's not going to win the election. I'm just excited about his uh, prospect of tanking Trump's uh, candidacy. I, I mean, like that Robert Kennedy has no chance of winning. Like, especially after the leaked audio of him saying that COVID was a Jewish conspiracy. You know, like I, I mean, like there's there's no there's no serious comeback from that. I, I don't I I don't think so anyway. I I would like to I would like to think not, but I do think it it appeals to the Trump voter. So, you know, we'll have to see. Damn, he said that. Yeah, he he like was caught on audio talking about how like the uh, the COVID virus was genetically engineered to spare the Ashkenazi. Like I, I mean, like dude. <laughs> Wolf Blitzer is still alive. They're still putting Blitzer on like their their biggest shows. Like it's crazy. Absolutely wild. I'm seeing progressive creators saying how the DNC is banning RFK Jr. from the ballot because he's a threat. Just keep pushing the GOP propaganda, useful idiots. Right? Like, no, I, I don't know. I think it's scummy of the DNC to, like, shut down some of the primaries when they could just hold the primary, even if it's not going to make a difference uh, about who gets nominated. Like, just, I, I, I disagree with the actions of the DNC on a lot of things, but I don't think, like, RFK Jr., like, not making it on the ballot is, is like, one of those things that I think is bad. All right. Let's check out this, uh, you know, since we're talking about RFK Jr., we'll watch the RFK Jr. ad first, huh? So on the 11th, Robert F. Kennedy Jr. tweeted out on Twitter, Our momentum is growing. It's time for an independent president to heal the divide in our country. Hashtag Kennedy24. Let's see, let's see what, uh, what RFK Jr. has for us, huh? <laughs> You want a man for president who's seasoned through and through. A man who's old enough to know. And young enough to do. Well, it's up to you. It's up to you. It's strictly up to you. American Value 2024 is responsible for the content of this advertisement. I feel like that was straight out of Monument Mythos, dog. I, like that, that th this is just the Monument Mythos, but in real life. My my God, um, yeah, they couldn't they couldn't come up with their own they couldn't come up with their own ad. They literally just reran an ad for for the first Kennedy. My God, there there is I I don't know anyone like younger than sixty 
who would see this and be like, well, that's interesting. That's, I'm going to consider voting for that guy. You know, like, my, my goodness. They ran this on the big, they ran this on the big game. Yeah, insane. Insane use of money. Paid for by American Values 2024. Out of curiosity. Values 2024. What is this? <sighs> House parties. Yeah, what 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 is what are the what are the policies? What do they want? Literally, it's just help us take back our government from corporate corruption. Yeah, I'm sure Robert F. Kennedy Jr. is going to be uh, your guy there. America moves. What is this? Enter a chance to win home gym equipment worth $25,000. Oh, my God. Oh, because Robert F. Kennedy Jr. is, like, such a, such a workout fiend. Okay, got, gotcha. Gotcha. It, it's, liter it's literally because he, he works out, so you should work out as much as Robert F. Kennedy Jr. Let's go. Well, so they're not official. Like, the interesting part about this is that um, American Values 24 is not actually affiliated with Robert F. Kennedy Jr. They advocate for him. They think they want him to be president, but they are not officially his super PAC. Can I box him? Oh, God. Aren't Wait, Malachi, aren't you like an actual boxer? You, you, like, wouldn't you kill him? Please don't. You can trust him with removing corruption. He has generational wealth. What's not to trust? <laughs> I did some jujitsu. Oh man, you'd murder that man. I don't. I don't think. I don't think. I don't think RFK Jr. can handle a. Uh, a fall or a full-on grapple. I, I don't get the impression that's uh, where his skills lie. With Justin Trudeau box him. Honestly, we just need to recreate the 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 Gundam Worlds uh, tournament. Have every nation uh, submit a Gundam. And uh, if uh, we can't get that uh, organized in the span of one year, then uh, we send out RFK Jr., okay? And Justin Trudeau sends out himself, obviously. Um, he looks like the Wish version of Vince McMahon. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Damn. All right.